Hi. Hello, good evening. Hello, how are you? My name is Roxana. Hello, Roxana, how are you? Fine. Nice, nice to hear that, nice to hear that. You? Very nice, very nice, as usual. Always. Always. Always, always. Very nice. Very very good and very nice. Very nice, very nice, always. Ya terminé mi, ya, ya terminé de hacer toda la, la tarea, ya, ya tengo mi certificado. Oh, that's good, nice, nice to hear that, very nice, congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome, you're welcome, Roxana. That is nice, you're the first one then, usted es la primera, entonces. Sí, that is, yes, yes. That is good to know, that is good to know, very good. I'm really happy, that, that is very nice. So with that, you already um, accomplished to get your spot on the next module for next year. Con eso ya asegura su puesto para una, una siguiente um, beca para el próximo año. Ya está asegurado que tiene su cupo reservado. Sí. Ya, ya, estamos, ya estamos descargando la, 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 la otra, las otras páginas para volverlas a, a enviar. Yes, very good. I like that. Me llega que haga eso. Very nice, very nice. Ok, let's see. Esperemos un momento mientras se, se conectan los demás, por Ok. Está bien, profe. Ok, doki.
night. Hello, good night. Welcome to the class. All right, I see that I have Catherine, Roxana, and Vanessa. Welcome to the class. Uh, in the name of English Corporativo, I'm giving you a big welcome. Remember that this class is possible because English Corporativo is giving you a scholarship uh, from Insofor. Okay, so let's begin. Um, who is missing? Waldir. Waldir is missing. And well, I don't know who, who else. Okay, guys, um, remember that yesterday we were practicing the simple present and we did, how many questions did we do yesterday? Do you guys remember how many questions do you ladies, ladies, do you remember? Question when? No, how many, how many questions? One, two, three, how many were there? Do you guys remember? Where, where no. do you? Yes, we did, but how many did we do? One, two, three, four. I know you understand. Hey. Hasta ya se oye el grillito. Cri, 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 cri. <laughs> no, we did seven. Siete hicimos. Seven. seven, seven, seven questions. So, mm -hmm. seven mm -hmm. information questions, okay? But, como decíamos, mm -hmm. we were doing a first person. Hicimos primera persona, okay? Mm -hmm. Remember? So, yes. we did, what do you do? I eat pizza. Where do you eat pizza? I eat pizza in Pizza Hut. Uh, when do you eat pizza? I eat pizza every day. Uh, why do you eat pizza? I eat pizza because I like it. Who do you eat pizza with? I eat pizza with my friends. Um, what kind of pizza do you eat? I eat a pepperoni pizza. ¿Sí se acuerdan que hasta ahí llegamos? Yes. Roxana, do you remember, Roxana? What kind of pizza do you eat? Yes. So we did seven questions. Cuatro, siete preguntas hicimos. En primera persona. So, hoy ocho. vamos a hacer ocho. ¿Cuáles yes. son ocho? Uh, what, where, when, who oh, is. Y what time también. Why, ah, pues what sí. time, how often, y what time. Ocho. Ah, pues sí. Thank you, Bane. Thank you. Okay. But, okay, so today we're going to do third person. Vamos a hacer tercera persona. So the third person is when two people are talking about somebody else. La tercera persona se da cuando eh, alguien está hablando, dos personas están hablando de alguien más. ¿Ok? Por ejemplo, nuestra tercera persona va a ser Homero Simpson. ¿Ok? Homero. Ok. So, vamos a empezar. Eh, that this is simple present, third person. Presente simple, tercera persona. Y recordemos cuál es el qué es el presente simple, ¿se acuerdan? What is the simple present? Mm, espere, 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 espere. Vamos a ver si los demás pusieron atención. ¿Se acuerdan qué es el presente simple? Alguien que no sea que no sea Vanessa, porque solo Vanessa responde. ¿Alguien se acuerda que es el presente simple? The simple present that's about habitual activities, general truth and customs. Very good, Ayote, Catherine. Nice. Yes. The simple present talks about habitual activities, general truth and customs. Mm, very nice. Nice, Catherine. Give me five, Catherine. High five. <laughs> okay. Bye. So, <laughs> me lo imaginé. So, okay. Um, so, that is that simple present. So, el presente simple habla de actividades habituales, eh, verdades generales y costumbres. Okay. So, ejemplo de actividades habituales. What is a habitual activity? Ahí está Gachauer. 
I take a shower. Very good. Well, dear. Nice. I take a shower. Ok, very good. Es, esa es una actividad habitual porque lo hacemos todos los días. Y de eso se tratan las actividades habituales que hacemos casi siempre. Ok, an example for... Um, an example for general truth. Ejemplo de una, de una verdad general. Where do you live? No. Esa es una pregunta de información. One direction? The direction? No. One All direction right. es el grupo que canta. <laughs> <laughs> I was kidding, but I'm sorry. Uh, ¿Cómo es el lugar donde vive? En... Mm. Ah, pero ¿cómo sería? Si quiero decir una verdad general. I'm from San Salvador. I'm from San Salvador. Mm -hmm. Esa es una verdad general. Pero si usted dice, where do you live? Esa es una pregunta. Ok. Ok, vale. So, otro, otro, para que les quede claro, a ver si les quedó claro. Otro ejemplo de, 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 um, de general, general truth. Another, another example, please. Another example. I, I go sure. I don't think I go to sure. Another example of general truth. My name is Alcides because nobody can change it. Si es, si es general truth es porque nadie puede cambiar esa información, ¿ok? Ok. Ok, so denme otro, otro ejemplo. Anybody, otro ejemplo. The general truth. Okay. Quiero saber que están, están 100% seguros de qué es. No. So, tenemos dos, the general truth. I am from San Miguel, my name is Alcides. Otro, una más para, para que me demuestren que sí lo, lo entendieron bien. La edad, podría ser. Ok, very good. So, ¿cómo sería? I am... Um, Mm. Ten, 22 years old. I am 22 years old. Bien, así, sí. Esa es okay. una, una verdad, verdad general. Ok, very good, general truth. Recuerden, es información que nadie puede cambiar, por eso se llama general truth. Ahora, una, ¿qué es custom? What is custom? Costumbre. Un ejemplo de costumbre. ¿Estás ¿Ah? ¿Ah? No, 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 no. Cla dígamelo claro. Un ejemplo de custom. I go to the church. I go to church. I go, I go to, to church. church. I go to church on Sundays. I go uh -huh. to church on Sundays. So, esa es una costumbre, ¿ya? O también puede ser de que usted tome café por costumbre también. So, I drink coffee. I drink coffee. Or I drink atol. <ríe> por costumbre, mm. atol. Atol de lote. I like atol de lote. Ok, good. So, there you have it. The, uh, the simple present talks about habitual activities. 
general truth and cost. Exactly. So esa es la pregunta. Cuando alguien le pregunte, hey, what is the simple present? ¿Qué van a responder ustedes? The simple present, the simple present is, is about, it's about the uh, activity, uh, general uh, truth and cost. Yes, yes. The simple present talks about habitual activities, general truth and custom. Esa es la respuesta. Very good. Luego decíamos, ¿cómo reconocemos? How do we recognize the simple present? ¿Cómo reconocer el presente simple? Because the UC accelerate the and does. Do, do and does. Because we use the auxiliaries do and does. Porque utilizamos los auxiliares do y does. <laughs> Por eso lo reconocemos, ¿ok? Y luego tenemos, eh, ¿cuál era la pregunta general? What is the general question for the simple present? What do you do? What do you do? ¿Qué significa? ¿Qué haces? ¿Qué haces? Very good, very good. ¿Ok? So, y ahí tenemos, ¿qué es el presente simple? ¿Cómo lo reconocemos? ¿Y cuál es su pregunta general? Okay. Son tres cosas, dos, tres datos súper importantes que deben de saber siempre acerca del presente simple, ¿ok? Ok, so number one, the simple present talks about habitual activities, general truth, and custom. Number two, we recognize the simple present because we use the auxiliaries do and does. And number three, eh, the general question for the simple present is what do you do? Que significa que haces. Very good, ¿ok? Ahora vamos a usar tercera persona. Vamos a hablar de... ¿De quién hablamos? Mm. Waldir, eh, ofrezca una tercera persona. ¿De quién quiere que hablemos? Uh. Algún compañero, digamos, algún amigo. Ok, de un, de un amigo. Sí, de una amiga de cualquier, de un compañero de trabajo, no importa, pero esa, esa, esa se va a volver la tercera persona. Digamos de que quiero hablar de Megan Fox. Yo quiero hablar de Megan Fox. ¿okay? ¿Sí conocen a Megan Fox? Sí. ¿Quién, es, ¿Quién es Megan Fox? Una de... de... La que sale en Transformers. Yeah, más famosa por Transformers. Yeah. Uh -huh. She is my crush. Ella es mi crush. ¿eh? So, por eso vamos a hablar de ella. Me dejó, pero igual. De vez en cuando me llama que quiere volver y yo le digo que no. no, no. Y se lo pierde. <risa> ok, va. Entonces tenemos a Megan Fox. So, general question. La primera pregunta es, what is Megan Fox? No, what does Megan Fox do? What does Megan Fox do? ¿Qué hace Megan Fox? What does Megan Fox do? ¿Todos? What does, does Megan Fox do? What does Megan Fox do? Very good. Megan Fox do. ¿Y cuál era eh, la, lo que está, qué verbo estábamos utilizando ayer? No, it. It. ¿Y cuál era el complemento? Pizza. Pizza, very good. Pizza. Va, entonces, la pregunta es, what does Megan Fox do? What does Megan Fox do? Todos. What, what does, does Megan, Megan Fox, Fox, Fox do? ¿Y cuál sería la respuesta? Ojo, cabe destacar que en presente simple, para las respuestas en tercera persona, el verbo, los verbos llevan S al final. So, sería, she eats. She eats pizza. Ella come pizza. She eats pizza. ¿Todos? She eats pizza. She eats pizza. She eats pizza. Ok, right, comencemos. Vanessa, what does Megan Fox do? Uh, she eats pizza. She eats pizza. Very good. She eats pizza. Good. Vanessa, as well, dear. Ok, well, dear. What does Megan Fox do? She eats pizza. Very good. Waldir, well, ask Catherine. Catherine, what, what does Megan Fox? No, 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 no. Well, what, does? what does Megan Fox do? Excuse me, excuse me. 
Catherine McDarsen, Megan Fox, tú. No, es que me dice dozen. Y ese dozen es negativo, pero en presente simple. Y es does. What does ah, okay. Megan Fox do? What does Megan Fox do? Hoy sí. She eats pizza. She eats pizza. Very good, Catherine. Eh, Roxana nos escucha, le podemos preguntar. Stephanie nos escucha, le podemos preguntar. Yes. Okay. Yes, teacher, pero yo acabo de entrar, no sé qué están preguntando. <laughs> Ok, ok, Stephanie. Um, solo escúchenos entonces y luego le, que se ponga el día y ya le preguntamos, ok. Um, ok, uh, Katherine, pregúntale a Roxana entonces. Roxana, what does Megan Fox do? Oh, oh. <risa> se me ha olvidado. Tan Fue rápido, olvidado. tan rápido. She eats pizza. She, uh, she eats pizza. She eats pizza. Okay. Vale. Eh, Stephanie, acabamos de empezar el, el, el presente simple, tercera persona. Ayer hicimos presente simple, primera persona. Creo que usted no estuvo en la clase, ¿verdad? Stephanie. No, no pude entrar ayer. Y, y vio, la, 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 el, uh -huh. vio el video después de clase. No, no pude. Es que tuve que hacer un, muchas cosas y no, no pude. Ok, súper. Pero sí estuve, estuve leyendo del presente simple en primera persona. Súper importante la, la clase de ayer porque explicábamos qué es, cómo es y dimos ejemplos e hicimos ocho preguntas y con respuestas del presente simple en primera persona. En cuanto tenga tiempo... Véalo y tome notas. Está súper bien ese, ese video de, de anoche. Hicimos okay, primera persona con, junto con la explicación y los ejemplos y respuestas. ¿Ok? Es lo mismo que estamos haciendo hoy, pero en tercera persona. ¿Ok? So, la primera pregunta que hemos hecho que es, What are you do? No, what, what do you do? Que es, ¿qué haces? Pero en tercera persona es, What does Megan Fox do? ¿Qué hace Megan Fox? She eats pizza. Ella come pizza. Y es la primera pregunta que se hace porque es la pregunta general. ¿Ok? Steph. Okay. Va, Stephanie, repite conmigo. What does Megan Fox do? What does Megan Fox do? Excellent. Y la respuesta es, she eats pizza. She eats pizza. Very good. Ok, Vane, pregúntele a Stephanie. Stephanie, what does Megan Fox do? She eat pizza. Very good, hoy sí. Ok, Stephanie, pregúntele a Katherine. Katherine, what does Megan Fox do? She eat pizza. She eats pizza. Very good. Ya ve, ya se puso el día. Porque apenas íbamos comenzando. Ok, let's go with question number two. Vámonos a la pregunta dos. ¿Cuál fue la pregunta dos, Vane? Sorry, le pregunto a Vane porque Vane tiene todos los apuntes. ¿La de ayer? Sí. sí, sí, sí. <ríe> ok. Question number two, Vane. La pregunta dos. ¿Cuál fue? Eh, where do you eat pizza? Where do you eat pizza? Pero en tercera persona, ¿cómo haríamos la pregunta? Mm, where does Megan Fox eat? Eat pizza do? Yes. No. No, no lleva el do. <risa> Lo hizo, pero le aumentó el do. No, no okay. lleva el do. So, so, okay. Where does Megan Fox eat pizza? Where does Megan Fox eat Eat pizza, todos. Where does, Where does Megan Fox eat pizza? 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 Todos. Where does, Where Megan, does Fox Megan Fox eat pizza? Y siguiendo el, el ejemplo de ayer, ¿cómo sería la respuesta? Megan. Mm -hmm. no. Solo, ojo, ojo, solo en la pregunta, sí. se ha, 
Ojo, solo quiero aclarar algo. Okay. Sobre la pregunta tienen que hacer, eh, poner el nombre de la persona. Ya en la respuesta se va a utilizar she or he. Okay? Okay. Solo en la pregunta va el nombre, pero en la respuesta va he or she. Okay? Okay. So, ¿Cómo sería la respuesta? She eats pizza. Y pizza, pizza hot. hot, yes. Cooks a lot. Y chi, no. No, un momento, Waldir, no se me brinque. Es que brinque, me salté. Chi okay. eats pizza. Big... Bah, ya, ya a mí me, me enredó también. <risa> <risa> Waldir. Ok. Uh, ok, es la dos, ¿verdad? Chi eats yeah. pizza in pizza hot. Chi eats pizza in pizza hot. Todos. Chi eats eat pizza in pizza hot. She eats pizza in Pizza Hut. 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 Good. Okay, so. Comencemos. Eh, Vanessa, where does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza in Pizza Hut. Very good. Mm -hmm. As well, dear. And Waldir, where does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza in Pizza Hut. Good. Uh, Waldir, ask Katherine. Katherine, where does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza in Pizza Hut. Yes. Um, okay, ask Stephanie. Stephanie, where does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza in Pizza Hut. As Roxana. Roxana, where does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza in Pizza Hut. Okay, Roxana, uh, are you paying attention? Because you take too long to answer. Remember that we only have one hour and we need to take advantage of this, okay? Uh, okay, let's move on. Um, good. ¿Quién está de más? Vamos a ver. Estaba alguien más. Se fue. Okay, um, what is number three? Vane, what is question number three? Okay. Uh, when do you eat pizza? When, when. So we have what, what, what and well. where. Ahora, when. when. Okay. So what is the question? What is the question with when? Mm, when does? When does? Uh, Megan, Megan, Megan Fox, Fox eat pizza. Yes. When does Megan Fox eat pizza? Todos? When does, when does, does Megan Fox, Fox, eat, Megan pizza? Fox eat pizza? When does Megan Fox eat pizza? When does, when does Megan, Megan Fox, Fox eat pizza? Eat pizza? When does Megan Fox eat pizza? When does Megan Fox eat pizza? Guys, solo ve oigo que Vanessa y Waldir repiten. Okay. Um, so what would be the answer? She eats pizza every day. She eats pizza every day. Very good. She eats pizza every day. Repeat. She eats pizza, she eats pizza, every, pizza day. every day. Pizza every day. She eats pizza every day. She eats pizza every she day. Eat. Okay, good. Okay, um, well, dear, when does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza. She eats. Excuse me. She eats every day. Mm -mm. She eats pizza every day. She eats pizza every day. Good. Pregúntele a Katherine. Katherine, when does Megan Ford eat pizza? 
We eat pizza every day. Catherine as Stephanie. Stephanie, when does Megan Fox eat pizza? He eats pizza every day. Good, as Bunny. Bunny, when does Megan Fox eat pizza? He, she eats pizza every day. Good. Okay, what is the next question? What is number four? A la cuatro vamos, ¿verdad? Yes. So what is number four? Who with? Who with? ¿Y qué significa who with? ¿Con quién? ¿Con quién? Vamos okay. a averiguar con quién está comiendo pizza. ¿Con quién come pizza? Okay, um, so what would be the question? The question. ¿Cómo sería la pregunta? Who does the box eat pizza with? Thank you, Stephanie. Who does Megan Fox eat pizza with? Who does Megan Fox eat pizza with? Todos? Who does Megan, Megan Fox eat pizza with? Eat pizza with. Eat, eat pizza with. Who with. does Megan Fox eat pizza with? Todos? Who does, does Megan, Megan Fox eat pizza, pizza with? Pizza with. Who does Megan Fox eat pizza with? Todos. Who does, Who does, does Megan Fox, Fox eat pizza, pizza with? with? Good. So, ¿cuál sería la respuesta? She eats pizza. She eats pizza. With your friends. With your friend. With my friend. My, your. Ah. Your. <laughs> she eats pizza with her friends there you go thank you steph yes um she eats pizza with her friends o puede ser que lo más ideal sea she eats pizza with the teacher huh <laughs> no? <laughs> no okay no hasta el, grillito, hasta el grillito dije cri, 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 cri. no okay she eats pizza with her friends todos she, she eats, eats pizza, pizza with her with friends she eats pizza with her friends she eats pizza with her friends. Oh, with her friends, con el, los amigos de ella, no con mis amigos, con los with amigos. With her friends. With her friends. With her friends. She eats pizza with her friends. Otra vez. She, she, eats, eats, pizza she eats pizza with, with her friends. friends. Very good. Okay, uh, um, Stephanie, who does Megan Fox eat pizza with? Eats pizza with her friends. Good. Ask Waldir, please. Waldir, who does Megan Fox eat pizza with? She eats pizza with her friends. Mm, no. She eats pizza with her friends. She eats pizza with her friends. No, her, her friends. Her. Okay. She eats pizza with her friends. Friends. Y le faltó la S, eats. Otra vez. She eats pizza with her friend. Her friends. Her friends. Plural. Okay. okay. Well, dear, as um, a quien? Uh, Catherine. Catherine. Who does, who does Megan Fox eat pizza with? Thank you. She eats pizza with her friends. Good. As Bunny. Vanessa, who does Megan Fox eat pizza with? She eats pizza with her friends. Good. Vanessa, yo veo que se está, se está durmiendo, está cansada. Hey. You're tired? Are you tired? <laughs> no. Al rato vamos a oh, escuchar los ronquidos nada más. No, no ronco. Eh, no sé. <laughs> Ok, ok, let's move on. Ok, sueño, sueño, no, no sueño. Ok, ok, let's move on. So, what is question dicen, number five? Dicen. What is question number five? <laughs> Why do you eat pizza? Yes, pero esta sería la número cinco, ¿no? Sí. Yeah. Ok, good. Why does... Megan Fox. Megan Fox... Eat pizza? Yes. Why does Megan Fox eat pizza? Todos. What does Megan Fox eat pizza? What does Megan Fox eat pizza? Why does 
Algunos me dicen what, no es what, es why. Why does Megan why? Fox eat pizza? Why does, why does Megan Fox, Fox, Fox pizza? eat pizza? Why does Megan Fox eat pizza? Why does Megan Fox eat pizza? Okay, so why does Megan Fox eat pizza? One more time. Why does, why Megan, does Fox Megan Fox eat, eat pizza? pizza? Okay, so the answer. What is the answer? Uh, she eat pizza because, because I like. I like it. Mm -hmm. I like it because she like it. She likes it. La S. She likes, likes it. it. Huh. Es así, miren. Cuando yo digo me gusta, I like it. Cuando le mm -hmm. digo a ti te gusta, you like it. Pero cuando es tercera persona decimos a ella le gusta, she likes it. Y cuando es a él, he likes it. ¿Ya? Likes a, it. a él le gusta, he likes it. Y a ella le gusta, she likes it. La S lo hace así, ¿ok? Likes it. ¿Ok? So sería, she eats pizza because she likes it. ¿Todos? She eats pizza, she eats pizza because, because she likes she, it. She likes it. Mm -hmm. She eats pizza because she likes it. She, she eats, eats pizza, pizza because, because she likes, she likes it. it. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, uh, Stephanie, why does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza because she likes she likes it. Yes. Okay, as um, as Stephanie. So Stephanie. Oh, my bad. <laughs> sorry, sorry. My bad, my bad, my bad. I'm really sorry, really sorry. Vanessa le pasó el sueño. No, no, no. Yo no. tengo el sueño, pero él le dio el yo, efecto. No, yo, te, yo siempre tengo mi discoteca aquí. Escuchen, escuchen. Yo, yo no me puedo dormir, ¿ok? Ah, always. So, I cannot oh. go to So I cannot go to sleep, you know, because I have music. Okay, um, so as as well, dear then. Sorry, Stephanie. Okay. Well, dear, why why does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza because she likes it. Very good, well, dear, well, dear, as as Roxana, please. Okay, Roxana. Why does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza she likes it. Because she likes it. Very good. Okay, Roxana, as um, Stephanie. Wait, no. <laughs> as Bunny. Uh, Vanessa? Yes, please. Thank you. Why does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza because she likes it. Good. Okay, Bane, ask me. Uh, Tony, why does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza because she likes it. Okay? okay. Ella come pizza porque a ella le gusta. Because she likes it. Okay? Good? Good. Okay, so let's go for number six. What is question number six? What time? Yes. Mm -hmm. What time? So, ¿cómo se haría la pregunta? What time does What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? Yes. What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? Todos. What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? Okay, well, dear. Time. No me diga what time. Time no existe. Time. 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 Como lleva la M, como lleva la M es time. La, los labios se juntan. Time. 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 Como, cua, como cuando tenemos hambre y olemos la comida que está haciendo el vecino. Mm. ¿Ah? Mm. Yeah, así time. es. What time? What time? What time? Yes. What time is Megan Fox? Eating pizza. eating pizza. What time is Megan Fox eating pizza? 
What time Megan Fox eating pizza? Se le olvidó el list. What time is Megan Fox? Wait, 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 momento, momento. Ya me fui a otro lado. Es, es el presente continuo. No. Estamos haciendo el presente simple. Sí, sueño, my bad, my bad. Y dice que no. No. No, oh my God. no, 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 it's not sueño, it's not sueño. Okay, what time does Megan Fox eat pizza? What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? What, what time, time does, does Megan Fox, Fox eat, eat pizza? pizza? What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? Todos? What, what time, time does, does Megan, Megan Fox, Fox eat pizza? Eat pizza? Okay, so, yes, what time does Megan Fox eat pizza? 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 Hey, ¿qué pasó con Firulay? Firulay está bravo. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so what would be the answer? What would be the answer? What would be the answer, guys? What would be the answer? The answer, please. Ah, la respuesta. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Yes, thank you, well, dear. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Todos? She eats pizza at 9 p.m. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Well, dear? She eats pizza at 9 p.m. No, 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 well, dear. Primero, acuérdese que el eat lleva ese. She eats pizza. Y luego se dice at. At 9 p.m. She eats pizza at... at no, no, no. At at, at, at. at 9 p.m. Otra vez, por favor. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. No, no. At. At. at Otra me? vez. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Cool. Ok. Ok, comencemos. Well, dear, what time does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Yes. Pregúntele a Stephanie, please. Stephanie, what time does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Good. Tengo una pregunta, teacher. ¿Quién es, Steph? Sí. Ok, no. pre pregúnteme. Shoot me. Se puede contestar también she eats pizza at lunch. No, porque específicamente es what time. Tenemos que usar la hora del reloj. Es específico. Okay. E e esa de lunch la podemos usar tal vez en when. When does Megan Fox eat, eat pizza? She eats pizza at lunch. She eats pizza at dinner. She eats pizza at breakfast. Ahí sí. Pero con el what time tenemos que usar a fuerza una hora. ¿Sí me entiende? Mm -hmm. Porque yes, dice específico, what time. Pero en when sí podemos usar lunch, dinner, breakfast. ¿Ok? Ok. Thank you, Steph. Um, ¿Dónde nos quedamos? Oh, Steph, pregúntele a, a quién. A Roxana. Pregúntele a Roxana, Steph. Roxana, what time does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza at 9 p.m. She eats. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. La, la, en eat lleva ese al final, Roxy. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Oh, I see. Very good. Thank you. Okay, ask Catherine, Roxana, please. What time does Megan Fox eat pizza? Eat pizza at 9 p.m. Good, good, good. 
Ok, um, ¿quién falta? Ok, Catherine, as, as, as Stephanie. No, Stephanie ya contestó. Ah, Vane, Vane, as Vane, please. Vanessa, what time does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza at 9 p.m. ¿Quién falta que le preguntemos? Usted. Ah, oh, a mí, ok. Ask me. <laughs> Ask me, Vane. Tony, what time does Megan Fox eat pizza? She eats pizza at 9 p.m. She eats pizza at 9 p.m. Good? Good. Okay. Well, ¿Qué pregunta nos falta? Mm, okay. ¿Y qué número es? Siete, ¿verdad? Yes. Siete, siete. So, ¿Cómo sería? ¿Qué significa how often? ¿Qué tan a menudo? Ok, ¿qué tan a menudo? ¿Con qué frecuencia? ¿Con qué frecuencia? Ok, ¿qué tan a menudo? Yes, está bueno, válido. Ok, so, um, so, what is the question? How often does, does Megan Fox eat Megan pizza? Fox, very good. How often does Megan Fox eat pizza? ¿Todos? How often... How often does, does Megan Fox, Megan Fox eat, pizza? eat pizza? How often does Megan Fox eat pizza? Otra vez. How often, How often does, does Megan Fox, Megan Fox, Fox eat, pizza? eat pizza? Okay. How often does Megan Fox eat pizza? How often does Megan Fox eat pizza? Good. ¿Y cómo respondemos? Mm. Sí. 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 Mm, 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 mm. Va un, un, una de frecuencia. Always bien. Always. She always, she always eat pizza. Eats pizza. She always eats pizza. Todos. She always eats pizza. Always. 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 She always eats pizza. She always eats pizza. She always eats pizza. Okay, let's begin. Um, do, 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 do. Stephanie, how often does Megan Fox eat pizza? She always eats pizza. Ask Catherine, please. Catherine, how often does Megan Fox eat pizza? She always eats pizza. As well, dear. Well, dear, how often does Megan Fox eat pizza? She always eat pizza. No, heat. Heat is calentar. Eat. Eat. Excuse me. She always eats pizza. Está diciendo calentar. Siempre calienta la pizza. Eat. <laughs> bueno, primero, primero la tiene que calentar para comérsela. Sí, es cierto. A veces. Eat. Eat. Mm -hmm. She always eats pizza. Oh, sí. Oh, sí. Excuse me. Vale, so, hago énfasis en eso porque a veces eh, si usted hace una pronunciación mala, por poquito que sea, quiere decir otra cosa. Imagínese, Waldir quiere decir que ella come pizza, pero él dice hits, entonces la calienta, calienta la pizza, no se la come. Entonces, una pronunciación por poquito mala que esté, ya quiere decir otra cosa. ¿Sí me entienden? So, hay que tener mucho cuidado en la pronunciación, ¿ok? Um, ok, Waldir, haz... Um, as, as, Vanessa. Vanessa, how often does Megan Fox eat pizza? No, en la pregunta no lleva it, solo lleva it, no lleva ese. Solo en la respuesta va a llevar ese, ¿ok? Ok. Vanessa, how often does Megan Fox eat pizza? She always eats pizza. Good, Vane, ask Roxana. Mm, Roxana... How often does Megan Fox eat pizza? She, she always eats pizza. Yes, Roxana, ask me. How, how often does Megan Fox eat pizza? She always eats pizza. She always eats pizza. She always eats pizza. She always eats pizza. Huh? Okay, what is okay. it? 
¿Cuál es la pregunta? La última. ¿Cuál es la last question? What kind? What kind? What kind of? What kind of? ¿Y qué significa what kind of? What kind of? ¿Qué tipo de pizza o qué clase de pizza? Very good, very good. Ok, hagamos la pregunta entonces. Let's make the question. What kind of pizza does Megan Fox eat? What kind of pizza does Megan Fox eat? ¿Todos? What kind of pizza does Megan Fox eat? 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 What kind of pizza, what kind of does, pizza Megan does Megan Fox eat? Okay. So, la respuesta cuál sería? What, is, what would be the answer? Eat pepperoni pizza. She eats pepperoni pizza. Todos? She eats, she eats pepperoni, pepperoni, pepperoni pizza. pizza. She eats pepperoni pizza. She, she eats, eats pepperoni, pepperoni pizza. pizza. Good. Very good. Okay, um, Catherine. What kind of pizza does what? Megan Fox eat? He eats pepperoni pizza. Mm. Ask Roxana. Mm. Roxana, what kind of pizza does Megan Fox eat? He, she, 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 she eats pepperoni pizza. She eats pepperoni pizza. She eats pepperoni pizza. Okay, as Vanessa, Roxana. I, what kind of pizza does Megan Fox eat? Mm -hmm. Yes. She eats pepperoni pizza. Okay, as Stephanie. Stephanie, what kind of pizza does Megan Fox eat? She eats pepperoni pizza. Thank you. Ask Waldir. Waldir, what kind of pizza does Megan Fox eat? She eats pepperoni pizza. Good. Waldir, ask me. Tony, why? On the bed. On the bed. Uh, of pizza does Megan Fox eat? Yes. She eats pepperoni pizza. She eats pepperoni pizza. Okay. Um, ahí terminamos todas, ¿vale? Yes. Okay. Incluyamos una nueva. Busquemos una nueva pregunta. O, mejor dicho, vamos a comenzar otra. Otro tiempo. Ese es el presente simple. Very important. That was the simple present. Now let's go for eh, present continuous que es otro presente, pero es el presente continuo. ¿Ok? So, veamos qué es el presente continuo. What, what is the simple present? present. The present continuous. What is the present continuous? ¿Todos? What is the present continuous? 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 Okay. Right. Esa es la pregunta. Ahora la respuesta. Cuando alguien le pregunte, um, Roxana, what is the present continuous? Y usted dice, ah, eso sí me acuerdo. Y usted le va a decir, ah, is an action or verb that is happening at the moment. Is an action or verb that is happening at the moment. Es una acción o verbo que está sucediendo en el momento. Eso significa el presente continuo. Is an action or verb that is happening at the moment. Repitan. Is an action or verb that's, that that is happening at the moment. That is happening at the moment. That is happening at the moment is an action or a verb that is happening at the moment. Is an action or verb that is 
that is happening at the moment. It's an action or verb that is happening at the moment. It's an action or verb that, that is happening at the moment. At the moment, Waldir. At the moment. 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 My teacher sees it. Okay, let's see. Stephanie, what is the present continuous? It's a action. It's it an action or verb that is happening at the moment. Thank you. As Catherine. Catherine, what is the present continuous? It's an action or verb that is happening at the moment. Thank you. As Vanessa. Vanessa, what is the present continuous? Mm, is an action or verb that that is happening at the moment. Good. As Waldir. Waldir, mm, what, what is the present continuous? It's action or verb that is happening on the moment. At the moment. At the moment. You yeah. as Roxana. Roxana, what is present continuous? Continuous. Roxana, what is present continuous? Is the action the orbit that's happening in the moment? Mm. Is an action or verb that is happening at the moment? Is the action is an or, is an action or verb? Is an, is an action or verb that's happening in the moment? At the moment, is an action or verb that is happening at the moment. Okay, so es un verbo es un verbo es una acción o verbo que está sucediendo en el momento. Y este es el segundo tiempo de en inglés. El primero fue presente simple. Y este es presente continuo, una acción o verbo que está sucediendo en el momento. Now, how do we recognize, how do we recognize the present continuous? How do we recognize the present continuous, todos? How do, how do, how do we recognize the present continuous? How do we recognize the present continuous? How do we how do we recognize the present continuous? 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 How do how do we recognize the present continuous? Okay. Continuous. ¿Y cuál sería la respuesta? ¿Tienen alguna idea? ¿Cómo reconocemos el presente continuo? Porque usamos ing al final de los verbos. Because we use ing at the end of verbs. Because we use ing at the end of verbs. Todos? Repeat, please. Because we use ing at the end of verbs. Eh, chicos, lo que he estado notando es que ustedes pierden el tiempo en estar escribiendo. Estamos aquí... Tienen que escuchar y repetir y entender, no escribir. Para escribir, vean el, 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 el video otra vez y ahí toman nota. Porque aquí, miren, se perdió el tiempo, ya, ya, ya casi se nos acabó la hora. So, tenemos que hacer eso, ¿ok? Repetir, entender, repetir, entender, ¿ok? So, um, how do we recognize the present continuous? Because we use ing at the end of the verb. Because we use ing. No, because, because we use, use ing, ing at the end of the verbs. And at the and end of the verbs. At the end of the verbs. Porque usamos ing al final de los verbos. Por eso lo reconocemos. Okay? okay. Because we use ing at the end of the verbs. Todos. Because we use because we ing use it, uh, ing at the end the of the verb. Because we use ing at the end of the verbs. Because we use ing at the end of the verb. Oh, oh. 
Let, let's do this because use ing at the end of the verbs. Esto es lo que deberíamos de haber estado haciendo desde ya ratos, solo repitiendo y entendiendo, repitiendo, sí, entendiendo. Sí, sí. Pero ustedes se ponen a escribir y, y perdemos demasiado tiempo así. Por eso es que se, 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 por eso se comparte el video después para que ustedes tomen, tomen notas. Ahorita aquí solo es repetir, entender, repetir, entender, no hacer nada más. Um, ok, so, veamos a ver si, si lo tenemos bien. Hey, Catherine, how do we recognize the present continuous? Because we use ING. And the I, the verbs. At the end of the verbs. At the end at of the, the verbs. End. Al final de los verbs. At, at the end of the, the verbs. End. Of the verb. Okay. The as as a Stephen. At the end of the verb. Stephanie, how do we recognize that person continues? How do we use ing at the end of the verbs? Good. As Vanessa. Sí, es que... ¿Cómo se reconoce que el presente continuo? Porque usamos... Porque usamos ING... No, porque usamos ING... Porque usamos ING... Porque usamos ING... El alfabeto, I. Vanessa. Vanessa, el alfabeto. Uh. Tiene que repasar el alfabeto. It is A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, C, D, O sea, es A, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, O, I, N, G. Because he used I, N, G. At the end. Because he used I, N, G at the end of the verb. Ok, as well, dear. Ay, la pregunta de acuerdo. Uh, but, how do but, we recognize? How do you recognize? How do we? How do we recognize? How do we recognize? The present continuous. The present continuous. <laughs> well, here? Because, because we use ing on the end verb. At the end. At the end. On of the, the end verb. Okay, very good. Very good. Well, dear, ask me. Wait, ¿a quién no le hemos preguntado? A Roxana. ¿Cuál dirá Rosa, Roxana? Ok. Se me estaba escapando, Roxana. <risa> Roxana. <risa> Roxana. Estaba allí. Roxana, how do, how do we... How do we... How, how, do, how, do, we, we? how do we recognize the present continuo? Yes. Yeah. Because, 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 because we use... Because we use, because we use ing, ing, ing at the end of the verbs. At the end, at the end of the verbs. Okay, ojo, nos quedamos... Ok, no, eh, nos quedamos allí, se nos acabó el tiempo, se nos acabó el tiempo. Wait, 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 let me do something here. Ok, um, se nos ha acabado el tiempo, so we're going to stop here, but we're going to continue tomorrow. We're going to continue tomorrow with the present continuous, ok? So, okay. al finalizar este módulo, tienen que haber entendido... Bueno, en el módulo 1 tuvieron que haber entendido el presente simple y el, y el presente continuo. Pero veo que lo tienen que repasar otra vez. Uh, so we're going to do that tomorrow. Vamos a continuar con el presente continuo, ¿ok? Tanto en primera persona y vamos a tratar de hacer tercera persona. So estemos temprano okay. porque recuerden que mañana es el día último de ustedes conmigo, ¿ok? Yes. Ok, y recuerden, terminen la, la plataforma para que reserven su cupo para la, 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 la siguiente, el siguiente módulo en enero del próximo año, ¿ok? Ok. Cool. So, have a good night, sleep like a baby, and I'll see you tomorrow, ¿ok? No. Have a good night. Have good a night. good night.
Good night, Good night, Good night, night Vanessa. Night. Now you can go to sleep. Ahora sí puedes ir a dormir. Ay, sí, ya. <laughs> Lo dejo. Bye-bye. Have a good night, guys. Bye-bye. Okay, bye. Bye-bye.